the Gunners progressed to the Final Four of the competition after defeating Napoli 3-0 on aggregate. In two impressive performances, Unai Emery's side completely shut down the Italian giants, who had been fancied as potential winners of the tournament. Despite Emery's side's heroics, the Europa League's team of the week failed to include any Gunners players. After the team was announced, Arsenal fans were enraged at the selection, after four Valencia players were selected including three from the back five. Other fans noted that Slavia, Prague managed to get two players in the team, despite losing both legs of their knockout tie against Chelsea. Arsenal fans didn't hold back when the team was announced, with one branding it an absolute joke, one fan fumed, ha 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 no at Arsenal players? This must be a joke. They kept a clean sheet away from home and yet there is no Arsenal defender in the team. Absolute disgrace, absolute joke, no Arsenal players, one wrote. Another posted, two Slavia players for losing both the legs, no Arsenal players for keeping back-to-back -back clean sheets against the best team in the competition, where are the Arsenal players? No luck is at absolute joke of a tweet, another wrote, you can't have the team of the week without any Arsenal players yet Arsenal had the toughest fixture and won convincingly, one fan pointed out. Alexander Lacazette's goal in Naples secured the 3-0 aggregate win for the Gunners, after a solid 2-0 win at home a week before. Emery's side showed great maturity in defending well against the formidable Napoli attack, and despite having just 30% possession, managed to stifle the hosts. Arsenal had just 7 shots compared to Napoli's 20, but Lacazette's first half goal was the difference between the two sides. Elsewhere in the Europa League, Chelsea beat Slavia, Prague 5-3 on aggregate to book their place in the Final Four and take another step towards an all-English final. Let's block ads. Why?